between the two engines? The internals. Okay, someone said dry sump, somebody said internals, but somebody said supercharger. The supercharger is the eliminating factor here. Because dry sump lubrication, we have dry sump on LT1. No problem, we got dry sump on LT5. Right? We got dry sump on both of those. That's not the issue. The issue is when you put a forced induction engine together, you are effectively shortening the life of your spark plugs. LT4 and LT5, you have to change your spark plugs at 60,000 miles, not 100 like the LT1. Big difference. You also notice that your engine lubrication oil life monitor changes quicker, depending on how much boost you're in. Yes, the computer knows that. Okay? Now, what other differences do we have? Now, you, I saw a lot of people looking at this. Does anybody have any idea what this is? This is your supercharger intercool bleed tool. LT4, LT5, specific. You have to change your coolant in your supercharger as well as the coolant in your radiator. Intercooling cooling systems require maintenance as well. So you have to change that. You can still go 100K, okay? It's, it's not going to be a big thing. You can still go 100,000 miles, but you still have to change it. 